Hello friends in this tutorial I will show you how to use HTML tag into PHP tag. Suppose friends you want to use HTML tag into this PHP tag. So friends you use echo statement and write ribs lesson. Then see output. Now suppose friends you want to use h1 tag into this PHP tag. So first you write echo statement in blank double quotation mark and write h1 tag and write ribs lesson. Now your browser display an h1 tag. You can also check by inspect element. In PHP tag you can also define input tag. For input tag you can simply write input text. Here friends you can see I use single quotation mark. But in HTML we use double quotation mark. But in PHP suppose I use double quotation mark then it will return syntax error. Now friends I define its value ribs lesson in refreshed browser. So you can see ribs lesson in input text. Friends same say you can also use variable in it. Now friends I define one variable and I define its value ribs lesson. Now I remove ribs lesson value of input text and I simply write dollar and I refresh the browser. So it is display ribs lesson in text box. So friends this way you can use variable with h1 tag. P tag etc. So, friends, suppose I write h2 tag and simply write variable and in refreshed browser. So, this way we can use variable with different HTML tag. Now, friends, I show you how to define table in PHP tag. I simply write open table and close table tag. Then I write table row open and close tag. Then I write to table data open and close tag. In first table data tag I write ribs lesson. And in second table data tag I write tutorial. Now I refresh the browser. So, friends you can see table on web page with value ribs lesson tutorial. So, this way we can define table in PHP tag. Now friends I show you how to use JavaScript into PHP tag. For JavaScript first I write script tag and close script tag into echo statement. Then I write alert with open and close bracket. Between bracket I write ribs lesson. Now friends I refresh browser. It simply display alert message on browser. Friends in JavaScript we can also use variable which I already define. So, I write dollar between bracket and refresh browser. It display alert message on browser. So friends this way we can use HTML tag in JavaScript into PHP tag. We can also use PHP code into HTML tag also which we will learn in the next tutorial. So friends thank you for watching this video. If you have any query regarding this video you can comment on this video I will reply on your comment. Friends you want to get more update of my video. So friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also. Or you can also follow Wibs Lesson on Twitter.